What's going on everybody? Anybody else in need of a haircut like I am? It's been about two months. Anyhow, today I want to go on a bit of a rant for today's tech tip about uh, something that upsets me in our industry and I'm going to show you how uh, to avoid that. So what I'm talking about is is people that are jamming probes in and front probing. Um, guys, I gotta tell you, if you're unplugging a connector for whatever reason and you're just touching your lead there uh, on a terminal, you're not gonna damage anything. But I run into case time after time where a technician is chasing after one problem and they're testing for powers or grounds or whatever. They jam their probe into the connector, spread a terminal, create another problem with a vehicle, and now we got more problems to solve. That's called human-induced error. What I want to talk about today are the uh, things that you guys should already have in your toolbox. Okay, we should probably have some T-pins. T-pins are a great uh, great way to do some back probing. Okay, you got to always be careful whenever you back probe not to over uh, extend your pin or crisscross within the terminal. Uh, we got standard back probes. You guys can use these. Also, I don't like to pierce probe. But I tell you what, sometimes I don't have much choice. The only way I can get into a uh, situation uh, properly is to pierce probe. And then also, every now and then, uh, depending on the situation, we can uh, probe into uh, a circuit uh, by the connector by using, uh, this is PCB wire, it's 30 gauge, super, super thin. But I got to tell you, you got to be real careful. Um, and I don't recommend you do it if you don't know what you're doing. I'm not responsible for your results there. What I'm getting at is we got to make sure we're not making uh, human induced error. We're creating more problems as we go through fixing the vehicle. Here's an example of this just recently. Somebody tested some other circuits and they tested a power for a PCM. Okay, good. This is going to help somebody else. There you go. I hope this helps you just think about it. If you're going to, if for whatever reason you're going to front probe, which if you take my electrical class, you know I don't recommend that. Make sure that you just touch the terminals. You're not jamming it in there, causing more problems than you're worth, all right? Because it's costing our industry probably millions of dollars a year by mistakes that people are making. So please, uh, back probe, pierce probe, maybe do that uh, little wire uh, into the circuit. You can do that as well. Um, but if you're going to front probe for any reason, do not jam your terminals in there. I hope everybody's doing well. Have a great day. Maybe the next time you see me, I'll have my hair cut, right? Bye-bye.